about a week since I poured that last final layer on the tray and I just got home three this morning and I just been taking care of the plant collection but before I pull myself together make myself something to eat do my face I needed to demold this because I've been thinking about it all week but before I do that I want to take out the moon and stars that I also poured right before I left they actually came out perfect I really like this second brand of resin how pretty that is that's one what's the other it came out perfect so I'm gonna make keychains out of these and I actually got my larger o-rings in the mail while I was away and they fit the moon perfect so I'm gonna make some really cool keychains but the star of the show now as you see the back of the bloom is sticking up and there's no way for me to do anything about that like the mold is not that thick so I might get feet for this tray and glue it underneath. We'll see. Oh my goodness. So here it is. It came out perfect. Let's go ahead and take a look at it in the light. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. Had I cut more uh, of this off, the petals of the bloom would have all came apart if i cut more of the back of the bloom so it is what it is all right you guys that is gonna wrap up today's video it was a part one and two i absolutely love this mold i'm gonna be making more things in this mold but as far as for the epiphyllum bloom it's just not deep enough but i knew that going into it i just love this tray a lot it's so so gorgeous i could even make little crystal molds here where you can set your rings on i might do something like that so this just might be the beginning to something new and exciting and as far as for like the bubbles there's a few but not a lot like how like seriously this is so gorgeous and as well as the moon and the stars so i'm going to be sharing these on both of the channels i really really love this new journey i'm on with my collection it's so cute it's so fun and it'll be nice that i'm able to also sell this to you guys if you guys want a part of the collection and it's just i love it a lot i'm having fun with comment resin. down below what do you think about my first tray this is my biggest piece to date this is just the beginning and i'm gonna go look online now for some feet that i can glue onto here and i'll be doing more work with this mold because this mold costs almost a hundred dollars believe it or not silicone molds are very expensive everything to do with resin is super expensive and resin in itself is expensive so since i'm all in i'm going to do some fun things with all of the molds i have and many more to come so give this video a big thumbs up now I haven't been doing resin for a long time and I've been sharing my journey on both of the channels and I feel pretty proud of myself. This is so stunning. So any suggestions down below on anything I could have done differently? What do you guys think about the gold leafing? I have so much. I'm going to have fun with it. And that's about it for now, guys. If you're new, welcome to the channel. Subscribe for daily uploads between the main channel, Monday, Thursday, and the vlog channel. Friday, Sunday, you get a video each and every day. Until next time, aloha from Santa Monica, California. Bye.